2025 is here. And in this video, I'm going to show you 10 books that you should read in 2025 to become better software and web developer. And I want you to start this year with something really important. Set the goals, read these 10 books, and by the end of the year, you will be really good software and web developer. These books are recommended by millions of engineers worldwide. So if you want to know what books are these, watch this video till the end. If you are ready, then let's get started. The first book in my list is A Clean Code by Robert C. Martin or Uncle Bob. This book emphasizes the importance of writing code that is not only functional, but also easy to read and maintain. If you want to elevate your coding standards and write code that other can easily work with, this book is a must. I believe it's good for all kinds of software engineers, regardless their level. The next one in my list, The Pragmatic Programmer. This book teach you how to think like a programmatic developer, someone who focus on efficiency, adaptability, and continued improvement. It covers almost everything from debugging to career advice. I haven't read it yet, but this is the book in my list. That's why I recommend you to read it as well. The next one is Code Complete. Some developers called it as the manual of software engineering. This book dives deep into the principle of writing high-quality code. If you are a developer and you want to improve your technical skills, then I recommend you to read it. The fourth one in my list, Why Programs Fail. The reason why I choose it because debugging is one of the most critical skills for any developer, and this book will teach you how to debug efficiently. If you want to master debugging, then definitely read this book. The next book in my list is a deep work. As developers, our work often required long periods of uninterrupted focus. And this book will teach you how to protect your attention. If you want to improve your productivity, then definitely read this book. The book number six is the refactoring. I think this book is really essential for developers who want to enhance the readability, maintainability, and scalability of their code base. It teaches you how to refactor safely and efficiently while minimize the risk of introduction bugs. I think this book is really useful for a software engineer at any level. Book number seven is System Design Interview. It is one of my favorite books about system design. Some people called it practical guide for async system design interview, but I think it's also give you good comprehensive understanding of system design in general. I definitely recommend you to read this book. The book number eight is Don't Make Me Think. If you're a web developer, I definitely recommend you to pay attention to this book. It basically focuses on creating web interfaces that are simple and user-friendly. If you want to know how to simplify complex usability concepts, then I recommend you to read this book. The number nine is Domain-Driven Design. If you're working on complex systems or collaborating closely with business stakeholders, I think this book will teach you how to bridge the gap between technical solutions and business needs efficiently. If you often collaborate with non-technical people, this book is really essential. And the last in my list, Design Patterns. I think understanding design patterns is crucial for building robust systems. In this book, you can find 23 design patterns that solve common software design problems. The good thing is that it's explained when and how to use these patterns. If you're working with OOP, then definitely read this book. That's it. Please set the target to read all of these 10 books. And let's come back to this video after one year and see your progress. I wish you good luck and I wish you the best in 2025. Thank you so much for watching this video till the end. Thank you so much for your support. This year will be great. And I hope to see all your comments about books that you read at the end of 2025. Bye.